CompTIA A plus Core 1 Complete Training Course. Exam Objective 1.4. Given a scenario, configure basic mobile device network connectivity and application support. Bluetooth Pairing. Bluetooth is a wireless technology that allows the exchange of data between different devices. With Bluetooth, you can connect devices like smartphones, computers, headphones, speakers, and even car audio systems without the hassle of wires. It's a technology that's all about convenience, enabling things like listening to music on wireless headphones or sharing files quickly between devices. But to do this, you first need to know a bit more about Bluetooth pairing. Pairing is the process of establishing a secure wireless connection between two Bluetooth-enabled devices so they can communicate with each other. And the process starts by enabling Bluetooth connections in the settings menu of your mobile device. Once your Bluetooth antenna is enabled and connections are allowed, the next step in the pairing process begins with placing the Bluetooth device you want to connect with into pairing mode. This is usually done by holding a button on the device, such as a long press on the power button of Bluetooth headphones. This puts the device into a state where it actively looks to connect with other Bluetooth-enabled devices. Next, you'll go back to the first device and search for available devices. This is generally done within the Bluetooth settings page, where you can scan for new devices. Once the second device appears on the list, you can select it to initiate the pairing process. Sometimes, you may need to enter a PIN code to complete the pairing. In the Bluetooth pairing process, entering a PIN code is an additional security measure to ensure that only users with the correct permissions can establish a connection between devices. The necessity of entering this code prevents unauthorized users from connecting to your device because without the correct PIN, the connection cannot be completed. This step is particularly important when pairing devices in public spaces where multiple Bluetooth devices might be present and the risk of an unintended or malicious connection is higher. After the devices are paired, they'll remember each other unless you choose to disconnect them or remove the pairing, meaning you won't have to go through the setup process every time. Lastly, disabling Bluetooth on your device is a straightforward way to conserve battery life and increase security. When you disable Bluetooth, you effectively cut off the wireless communication channel, ensuring that no Bluetooth connections can be made to your device without your consent. And to disable Bluetooth, just toggle the setting to the off position and you're done. Thank you for watching. Subscribe for more great content.